Hi everyone. Um, I thought I'd do another video um, to kind of explain a couple of the idiosyncrasies with the FDM Duo, using it as a standalone unit um, and with a computer. Um, now I use it as a standalone unit and control it from the computer in terms of uh, tuning etc. Um, and of course the frequency is shared. If you adjust the frequency um, on the unit, the frequency on the spectrum of course changes and vice versa. Um, but signal conditioning doesn't, it's actually independent. So what I've done is I've tuned to 15340, which is Reach Beyond Australia, um, broadcasting in Urdu. Um, and on the actual FM Duo unit itself, um, I've actually set some um, noise reduction. So if I just turn up slightly, you can see that um, I've got the noise reduction set to three. Um, and I've also got the um, automatic gain control on uh, set to medium. And so, and that's controlling the signal and affecting obviously the audio that you can hear now from the unit itself. But if you actually look on the other side here, you can see that on the, uh, on the software, the automatic gain control is off um, and the noise reduction is off. And so, and I have a spectrum, so if I turn the volume down on the unit and turn the volume back up on the computer, you can listen to the signal um, without noise reduction um, and without, without automatic gain, con gain control. Um, so they're completely independent. Um, the other thing is that for a noise blank or attenuator, all of these options, if I set them on the software, uh, it control it affects the signal the way that the signal is processed with the software and affects the audio uh, through the computer, but it doesn't affect the settings on the actual uh, FDM Duo unit itself. So effectively, you have com almost completely independent signal uh, manipulation. The only thing that's really shared is the uh, is the frequency in the actual mode. So um, if I were to just select upper sideband, then that affects the audio on the computer. But if you actually look uh, on the actual FDM Duo itself, that is also now upper sideband mode as well. So LSD affects both. So that's shared. So the actual signal mode is uh is shared um, in the same way that the frequency um, is shared um, now one thing actually if you go to uh am sync you can obviously do that on the software i've just done it but i don't know if you can actually do that on the fm duo itself um but again, as you can see, the um, the actual mode, the signal mode, is shared. But the all of the noise reduction, automatic gain control, noise blank attenuator, all of that's completely separate. So it means that if you're listening to a signal, and you can actually use both options, um, hear it with noise reduction, with automatic gain control, or hear it without anything um, on the computer. So it's quite good flexibility. Um, and that's one of the things, one of the sort of idiosyncrasies of this system, that it, parts of the functionality um, are shared between the computer and the FDM Duo and um, other sort of peripheral functions um, are independent, so, uh, which is quite useful. Uh, but I thought you'd find that uh, interesting, so um, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.